Okay, welcome Scootin. Now Scootin's having a problem with uh, the um, joining two sides together. Now I haven't even looked at this file yet, so uh, I'm new to this. So I'm just gonna open this one up and pull it out and have a look at what, oh right, okay, that's what we got, okay. So, uh, yeah, that's good. Um, I'm just looking to see whether I've got some faces on the inside here. Um, So that's the file he wants to join. So I'm just making sure he's deleted the faces out there, which he has, which is all very good. And that all looks good. So let me just go down here. Okay, so you've masked it, which is the right thing to do. Um, you got those faces. So really easy to join this because you've mirrored this across and you've gone off angle probably. Let me just check your, oh, that's all right. Yeah, so basically control, drag across here, right? Inverse it, control click, go to scale. Uh, just gonna make sure that my active symmetry is turned off and I'm gonna center this. Now by centering it and making sure you've got no faces on the inside, these little points are going to join up. Now I've centered it by hitting there. So all I need to do is bring this across like this so that they are over the top of each other. Yeah, and now I can go back to draw mode. And what we can do now is we can just use the world. So we can go down to modify topology and where we've got our world, because these are really close to each other, we can hit world points. So if I click world points, let me just turn on dynamic subdiv so you can see at the moment, it's like this, okay? Uh, remember we've masked this area up, so it'll only look at the ones that are close. It's done on the closeness of those files. So let me turn that back off again and go back into modify topology. And we're just gonna hit that world points. Now, if you don't see something happen, I might have to turn the world um, up and I can see now it's snapped back in. So now if I turn dynamics on, you're gonna see it's now one mesh like that. So a really easy fix there. Uh, no problem at all. You just need to make sure you're just doing that centering stuff, inversing, and then pulling those two bits together. All right, so that's it, done, complete.